Did Kong actually humble Godzilla in the fight? Now, I'm not talking about the Hong Kong battle. I'm talking about the Egypt battle. Uh, if you haven't watched GSK, which as of now, you should have at least a few days to watch it. So, <clears throat> yeah, it's out in cinemas now. Please do watch it before watching this video. Because this video will have a lot of spoilers and will pretty much spoil the entire Egypt fight. I'm not really bothered about if this video gets any views or not. Because this is just my opinion on the Egypt fight, so watch at your own risk by the way please like and subscribe if you don't want to watch it turn on all notifications for any favorite uploads and without a doubt let's get into it so we then see this is pretty much part two of my review of godzilla x kong the new empire part two pretty much did kong humble godzilla in egypt Let's examine the fight, right? So, Kong isn't really trying to kill Godzilla. Kong's just like... I mean, we even see by Kong's hand motions at the beginning of the fight, Kong doesn't want to fight. He's trying to lure Godzilla into the hollow if or drag him in at least to help him fight or get help against Shimo and the Scar King. Godzilla's having none of it because earlier in that film, spoilers again... He killed Scylla and Tiamat for pretty much no reason. He's not going easy on any of these Titans. So he's likely trying to kill Kong. Kong's going easy on Godzilla because he doesn't want his, his best hope of survival dying. Godzilla ends up flooring Kong. And Kong's like, you know what, if you want to have some of that, I'll punch you then. And then he delivers the meanest uppercut in history. Sending Godzilla flying to the ground. A lot of body pummels and bleep. Godzilla sumo wrestling Kong into the ground like John Cena. Body, like, bloody wrestling him. Boxing Kong. It's like a fight between a wrestler, Godzilla, and a boxy, Kong. Something like, I don't know, Mike Tyson against John Cena. I know Mike Tyson will absolutely buy John Cena. I, but if Mike Tyson was going easy on G John Cena, that would be the outcome. Pretty similar to that fight there. Godzilla pretty much body slams Kong several times. Kong, however, he pins Godzilla to the floor and starts punching him hundreds of times in a row. And then he starts dragging the almost unconscious Godzilla, who is now supercharged, now preparing to generate a blow of atomic breath. So hot that Kong has to let go. Kong then has to dodge the atomic breath. And if it wasn't for Mothra, I'd say Godzilla would have killed Kong with his atomic breath right there. If it wasn't for Mothra and Gia... Stopping them in Egypt. I think Godzilla would have killed Kong. I think, sure, Kong got the upper hand at the beginning of the fight. Well, I, I'd say Kong had a terrain advantage that we didn't know about in that fight. And neither did Godzilla. Therefore, Godzilla got bided in the first part of the fight. Uh, and to think that this was evolved Godzilla's first fight. Showing how absolutely destroyed by Beast Glove Kong, base, not even trying to hate Godzilla. Yet he still pummels Godzilla to the ground and gets hundreds of punches at once. That is just brutality there. That is just malice. I'm just saying, guys, this was probably the most entertaining film of my life. Sure, not the best storyline. I gotta go to something like that. I don't know. The original Jurassic Park or the original Godzilla, who knows? Godzilla Minus One, even. And I haven't even seen that film. Planning on doing a video about it, like, theory. So, anyway, I just want to know what you think. I think, God, sure, Godzilla lost the first half of that fight. I think Kong started to slack on the other half. Because the moment he looked away from Godzilla, Godzilla would have killed him. But what if Kong, if Kong didn't turn away, would he have killed Godzilla? Probably. The Beast Glove is extremely powerful. And as it said in the film, it makes one of the strongest Titans even stronger. 
So yeah, I think if Kong didn't turn away for just a second, but if Godzilla caught Kong off guard with his atomic breath at least once, sure, Godzilla would instantly get the upper hand. But anyway, hopefully you enjoyed, and bye. See ya.